I'm finishing this Marauder. I just thought I'd do a video tonight. Of model kits that we have. kind of give You just want to touch things up. A little detail here and a little detail there. Just to give it a little bit of neat look. Well, that one's shot. They get stuff in them, and then they're no good. You get a split hair. Yeah, that's a nice point. You know, these glasses, these are 2.5. They're not strong enough. I don't know what these are. These are twos. I wonder what a two plus 2.5, a little better. Now I need some brown. These are the bags. 
sleeping bags for the crew. Tents. Gonna go on the tank right there. That's gonna go on the side. color they don't show all the colors well Alrighty. You can't really get the camera right where you want it to be.
I just want more people to build model kits. Model building. Now let's paint the shovels. These dry. Uh. 
Tweezers. Goes on this side. Now, I always drop pieces, which Adam can tell you I do. Cut off all the extra flack as much as you can. It's just... Trying to build a model kit. Model kit building. Stress relieving. Stress relieving. Model kit building. Okay. Now, it's going to be coated again with a shellac, which gives it that rustic look. Plus, I'm going to use some wash on it to make it look dirty. All right. Now, on this side, we have some more um, equipment.
Now, where do those pieces go? Oh, they're right on the bottom. Well, let's see here. Alrighty, now let's take a break. Let's let that dry and let's do something different. So we have here the we have a enterprise. I want to tell you something about some about a model kit. So we're going to build the botany bay. Okay, now the botany bay is a very interesting vehicle. Okay, and I want to explain it to you because you might not know about the Botany Bay. Okay, so the Botany Bay was in Star Trek. Okay. And that was the um, Demon Seed, I think it was called. And that was the win when uh, Khan is introduced. Probably the top, one of the top five episodes of Star Trek, but you did not, you might not have known that the ship, the ship itself, the model that they made of it was actually a submarine. They used a submarine model kit, several submarine model kits probably, to create the Botany Bay. And you can see that when I put it together.
the superstructure has an appearance of a submarine. And they used submarine models to create the Botany Bay. Now, you might have known that, but I don't think you did. Now, where's the rest of it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I know why this was returned. <laughs> I'll tell you, people, they buy these things and then they don't put them together Oh my gosh. In the Botany Bay. Kind of neat design ship. It is, you know, it's a basic ship. All right. Now that's the Botany Bay. And this is the Enterprise. Someone started to build this and they sent it back. <laughs> that's so funny. Everybody's got to send things back.
First of all, why are there two nacelles? Two set of nacelles. The first pilot version and second pilot version in Mirror Universe. Oh, you replaced the nacelles. Okay, I know why it was returned. I mean, unless I can find these pieces. Ha! <laughs> Somebody must have started building this thing. And, um... Ha! <laughs> can you guess what pieces are missing? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. That's why this model kit was returned. Let me make sure here. Okay, guess what piece is missing from this model kit of this Enterprise? <laughs> and that's why it was returned. It was halfway finished, and then they sent it back. Anybody guess what piece is missing? Anybody guess? Anybody guess what piece is missing? Come on, man. Guess. Dun, 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 dun. Guess what piece is missing? And so I can't even finish. All I have is the space sheet speed ship. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. The piece, the piece that, the piece that holds on to the nacelles. So I, <laughs> that piece is missing. It's not here. It's complete boas, no mos, boros. It's not here. 
Let me double check, but I I I I, I, I can't find it. That's why it was returned. No nacelles. <laughs> That's funny. I've got the space, space seed. Dun, 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 dun. La, da, da. But they used a submarine to create this ship. All right, so I can't build the Enterprise because I have no nacelles, uh, uh, thing to hold the nacelles. So what am I going to do? Now I can redesign it and put like in in the there was a uh, uh, there was an Enterprise with just one nacelle. They kind of stuck it right here. They glued them like right here. Or I could mount them like right here. Two nacelles right there. Like, or I could put one in. Well, that's a bummer. I got to figure out how to do this now. So I can't finish that. All right, so let's see if we can finish this. Now this is a, uh, this one again uh, was half built. This is the Klingon, this is the Klingon, um, D7. Dun, dun, dun. I have no what I'm doing. I'm just putting things together. Now this is cool because it's um, painted in, or it's it's molded in different colors. It's molded in, in gray, like they've pre-painted this, which is kind of interesting. So they must have sprayed this in the factory. Dun dun. So I can't finish the Enterprise, but I can I can finish a Klingon D seven. Cruise battles cruiser. Bum bum ba dum. <laughs> Guess what's missing on this one? <laughs> you can't make this up. Oh my gosh. I can't I can't finish any of these kits. Well I can't I <laughs> I can't finish any of these kits. <laughs> I'm gonna cry! Oh my gosh, I'm missing. Okay, the kid must have lost this. Okay, something happened. You just don't, you, the, the, you can't miss this many parts, okay? I'm sorry, this is just unacceptable. This is just unacceptable. Outrageous! This is outrageous! It's missing the bottom plate to the ship and the other half to the nacelle. I can't even make the complete kit. Oh my goodness. 
I can't even partially build this thing. Oh my goodness, for the love of Mike. Oh my goodness. Uh, give me a royal fit. I need the other bottom part of this. You know what? See, this is the problem right here, guys. This is what happens is that is that somebody started building this and they didn't finish it and when and they said we're going to send it back, but they didn't send all the parts back. The rest of it is probably at their home and they just end up throwing it away. I can't believe this. Oh my goodness. I can only build I can only build the uh um Oh, oh, this is so frustrating. I can't even start finish it. This is beyond funny. I mean, this is beyond ridiculous. Unbelievable. I mean, it's a neat kit. It's got some cool parts to it. But my guys, I, I can't even finish it. I don't have the main parts. Huh, for the love of Mike. For the love of Mike. I mean, I have the engine cells, but Brian was showing us the old, old metal, metal models he just got really cool. I'll show you those in a minute. So here's the, here's the, here's the engine pods to the Klingon D7 Battlecruiser, which I can't put together because... I don't have the other, the other side of the battle cruiser. Oh my gosh. So this is the bottom.
I'm going to put together as much as I can put together. Dun 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 bum bum. I'm missing half the ship. Okay, so it's it's basically a half a. So it's gone through a warp. Oh, shoot, I just dropped. I just dropped in the cell. Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on. I just dropped in a cell. It's gone through a warp, and it's a half a ship. It's half a ship. I'm going to build half a ship. Half a ship. Good grief. I don't even have the top of the nacelle on. Ah, oh, come on. I can't even build the top of the ship. What a bunch of commie crap. See, this is why I cannot stand commies. You know what I'm saying? This is why I don't like communists. I, I have no tolerance for communists. You know what I'm saying? I, none. I don't have any tolerance for communists. All right, so we're gonna we can get the top of the we can get the top built, I think. So I can put half of the ship together. Okay, so this is the bridge. Dun, 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 dun. No, that's the bottom. You gotta be kidding. I can't even put the top together. That's the bottom of the top. <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. I really am. I mean, I don't know what to tell you guys anymore. It's really kind of bizarre. It, it's, it's useless. I can't put this together because half of the ship is missing. Okay, so this is all I can, all I can build, half the ship. I'm so, I just want to cry. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Well, I can't build any of these. I can't build this. I do have my uh, tank. It's coming along nicely. Unbelievable. problem is I got these models I paid for these models and then you can't even build the kit unbelievable I'll leave that that's the top I'll just keep that. That's garbage there. I'll keep that in here. I can't do anything with that because I don't have the rest of the I don't have the rest of the 
the freaking tank. All right, now let me show you these things. Now these were called Hubley metal kits. I think these were the neatest models ever made. And I remember building a lot of them when I was about nine years, uh, nine years old. Okay, they're made of metal. Solid metal. Okay. So, this is solid metal. Hubley. Hubley made in uh, Lancaster, Pennsylvania. See, that's what's so amazing is that these things were manufactured in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. And, and why we can't make these, it, it, it's government. That's why. They screw up everything they touch. So this is a metal kit. And every piece is metal. This is solid metal. And you basically screw it together now, what you do is you normally paint each, you paint the whole thing before you put it together. And I would hand paint them when I was a kid. See? Then you have the roof. I mean, they are beautiful. Then you have an axle. You have axles, tires, real tires. See, the tires are still, they're getting a little bad. Then what's really cool is the engine. Look at that, a, a, a two-stroke engine. You put a little gasoline in there and it, and, and it turns the, the uh, it has a single um, single piston. This is a single piston. You put a little oil in there, you light it, and then you got little, um, no, I'm just kidding. It doesn't really work. Um, but that's the engine block. And then it has the plastic interior with the seats. And then you have your front independent suspension. Check out that, isn't that cool? Your front grill. Isn't that neat? Well, I'd like to bring this company back again. There's so many things that I had when I was a kid. That would be cool to bring back. Jack Temple, send 50 cents. Okay, so here's the like, Send 50 cents in coins, okay, in coins, an end panel showing the stock number from any Hubley model to Jack Temple, blah, blah, blah. Join the Hubley Scale Model Club. Here's, here's a deal. You'll receive a three inch chrome plated die cast medallion. Hubley Scale Model Club. Isn't that amazing? Do not paint plastic parts with lacquer. This will wrinkle. Cr uh, cr uh. See, this is where they talk about flash. See the flash? There was a lot of flash on this because they were metal kits. The testimony to the popularity of the Model A is the existence of hundreds of Model A clubs all over the country. Of the original 5 million Model A Ford produced, there are 80,000 registered for daily use in the state of Pennsylvania alone. Guys, this was back in, when was this? It doesn't tell you, but this had to be in the 60s. 
it doesn't say when this was printed. Make your own repairs. Screwdriver assembly. Actual steers made of metal. Just like the original car. Model A Town Sedan. Isn't that cool? Isn't that neat? And then this is the pickup truck. I've got a pickup truck too. These are all the different ones they had too. I hope all the parts are in this. Looks like everything is here. So those are two Hibley kits. Well, I'm coming down to the end of this model. And you give it a little shellac coloring, which will give it a kind of a, a off color. And they'll do a little bit more detailing. And you've got yourself your first model kit. Very easy to make. Very easy to make. Just have fun building models. And then a diorama, add a diorama to it. Well, I can't finish the Enterprise. Shoot. That's too bad. Oh, well. Well, guys. I uh, hope you had fun watching me again. I don't feel very well. I haven't felt well since Monday. I had my teeth take, a couple of my teeth taken out over here. Been a hard week. It's been a hard week. I think if I was 10 years younger, I'd have been uh, more, I'm just getting tired, I'm getting old. I never thought I'd get old. Most people at this age are not going into business. Most people at my age are retiring. And I'm building up a toy store and hobbies. And it's a lot of work. A lot of work and a lot, of, a lot of, it's tiring. I don't want to complain or anything. I'm just telling you that it's been a hard week. struggling week but we appreciate everybody that watches uh, watch our live stream I only got 19 people watching it's not like I have a huge following but you guys have a great weekend um be safe this week <sighs> and we'll see you next time <laughs> you guys take it easy I don't have anything else to show you 
I don't have anything else to show you. See you later.